Coming at you from Tokyo, Japan, my name is Dave and this is my Panic ITB equipped Alteza. So what happened was I pulled all the injectors out to clean them and then realized that the seals were no good. They're all cracked. So in the interim, while I was waiting for the new seals to arrive, I just left this sitting here as you see it now. The fuel tank pressurized and started pumping petrol out of here. So much so that it soaked the rag and filled the cylinder to the point that it was coming out of these. It filled up my vacuum block, was dripping out of my ISCV, so I've pulled all that apart. It's got that much oil in it and that much gas. I've decided that it's probably a good idea to pull the plugs and actually double check the best I can that there's no fuel sitting on anything. I have got new plugs, but I won't be putting them in yet. So for spark plugs, I'm gonna be using these. Oh, I need to get these out. Oh, just a random zip tie. Get out, number one, number two, number three, number four. Find my plug spanner. It's not even a spanner, is it? Socket. Get them out of here. Can run them out with that. I've got it all back together. This side's all done. It's got oil in it. Um, it's got gas, it's got new plugs. And there's nothing left to do now than try and start it. So this is either gonna be really good or really bad. It runs. Oil pressure's coming up. Doesn't want to run though. It just won't idle anymore. Why won't you idle anymore? The ISCV wasn't plugged in. Wanted to idle, it just couldn't because I didn't plug in the thing that helps it idle. Makes sense, really, if you think about it. It just runs like trash. Ugh, horrible. Car runs, won't idle. 